hello guys welcome to c learning with new video in this video we will learn about lscp mode in our previous video we learn about manual mode of link aggregation uh, link aggregation is a grouping of physical interfaces these physical link are present between two switches we group these two link to make one logical link to increase the bandwidth between two switches uh, in lscp mode lscp is a link aggregation control protocol when we make these two link as in eth link link aggregation in one eth group so these uh, these two switches will exchange lapdus lapdus are packet uh, which are uh, negotiate between two switches to make one switch as a actor and other switch as a partner so actor will control all the activities and partner will follow its actor commands so what does actor do actor actor make the if there are many links present between these two switches and actor make some of the link as an active links and other link as inactive links so active link Uh, uh transfer the data and uh, inactive link will not transfer the data if uh, one of the active link fails so uh, so the inactive link with the highest priority will come in active state uh, these all functions are controlled by actor switch so we will proceed toward the configuration of uh, la lscp so we'll go in switch 1 and first of all we create eth trunk eth trunk so how many eth trunk can be created in one switch 64 so i will go uh, with number 1 so in one eth trunk you can group eight links eight link in one group and that's how you can create a 64 eth trunk in one router like uh, one eth trunk between these two switches where we bundle eight links suppose there is a second switch present here so this second eth trunk between these two switches so eight link they bundle in that eth so this switch have two eth in that case so now here so we have the we now we are in eth trunk 1 so here is a command mod lscp mod lscp static so now we are in lscp static mode so we will cut back and now we'll go to interface sorry interface ethernet 0/0/3 slash slash and make this interface as a part of eth trunk 1 eth trunk 1 and now we'll go to another interface interface 001 and make this interface as a part of eth trunk 1 so we configured now we'll go to second switch system view uh interface eth trunk 1 ethernet sorry eth trunk 1 trunk 1 and uh, mod lscp lscp static quit back now we'll go in interface ethernet 0/0/1 and make this interface a part of eth trunk 1 and we'll go to interface 2 interface 2 and make this interface as a part of eth trunk 1 now we configure uh, eth on both switches now we'll display display eth trunk 1 so you can see that uh, system priority is due to 768 and uh, the system with highest priority act as actor and the system id is this this is the mac address of the system least number of active links in one eth group uh, at least one link should be present and active and maximum eight links maximum these are two links so maximum we can bundle eight link in one eth so that's how 
uh, we create 64 eth in one switch and one eth contains 68 links and number of port in trunk so we use two ports one port is ethernet 003 and other port is ethernet 001 these two are selected and port type is m mega megabytes and uh, system priority is 3276 we can change the system priority and uh, lower the value higher the priority and uh, that that switch that device with the highest priority will act as an actor so here port port key and uh, other ports are present so that's how so we can change a uh, LCP priority, LCP, LCP priority, priority to hundred, hundred. Now we'll go to interface. Now we change the system priority. If we display, sorry, display ETH trunk. Now, yes, here you can observe that the system priority is now hundred. So this will act as an actor. so you can also change the priority of ports as well if we go interface ethernet 0/0/1 slash slash and lcp la cp priority priority to 100 of this interface interface 1 now if we display display you can see that now here eth trunk eth001 ethernet 001 that the port priority is 100 we change the port priority as 100 so why we change the port priority as 100 because i told you that if uh, some of the links uh, are in active state and other are in active state the from inactive uh, uh, links the link with highest priority the lowest value or the highest priority will come first as an active link so that's why we change the priority and uh, the system priority we change due to make is an actor so that's how lcp work so thank you if you have any questions so you can ask in comment so see you in next video